Hello, audience. This is Hooked Assassin bringing you towns. <clears throat> so, I went ahead and decided to start recording again because I did a couple things. Got some stuff cleaned up. Um, and so I figured I'd start recording because I actually went ahead and started telling him to put in some windows. So, <clears throat> they're uh, in the middle of hauling a bunch of stuff. They're going to haul sand and glass and stuff over there. I've got them just doing hauling mainly right now. They got these chess tables finally built. And uh, they're prioritizing on hauling and, I guess, building these windows. Which actually looks pretty nice. I've also got them building two down here next to the market. And uh, once they get that done, we will try to come over here, build Ulrich's place, and then we'll come down here, clear this stuff out, and get them to build more personal areas, because the more people we have in here, the faster all this will go. So, yeah, those windows actually look pretty nice. I put a lot in the dining hall. I didn't want to put too many on this side because all you're looking is at is cactus. So I put one there and then decided, nah, that, that doesn't really look very good, so. I went ahead and decided not to do any more. What she got? She got glass, so she's going to be making a window as well. And that should be second to last one. And she's got the last one, so what are these guys going to do? They're just going to haul. Alright. And that place will be filled up pretty fast with sand. In the meantime, they've still got plenty of food. They don't have much. Let's see, they've got cactus fruit milk. Let's make them get some... How much milk and everything do we have? We've got 20 milk. How many cactus fruit? 40 cactus fruit. Okay. So we'll go ahead and have them make some more bowls of soup. And that way they'll have plenty of that. Now they've still got plenty of meat, obviously. They've got... Let's see... 19 cooked steak and a cooked poultry still. So they've still got quite a bit. But having that extra soup never hurts. Um, in the meantime, they'll continue to haul this sand out of the way. And I can uh, go ahead and probably start on Ulrich's room here. We're going to make it decently large. And we'll probably connect the barracks onto this as well, actually. Barracks. It'll be very big barracks. But, uh... It's a barracks nonetheless. So they can't really complain. And... Once they get all that sand out of there, it'll be a lot easier. But, no, I can't, so I can't do walls right now. We will construct some roads. We'll probably just do a road that goes down and has it going over this way. And that's not what I want to do because that's going to take out the wall. So, realistically, we just want it about there. And then, if we go into furniture, we'll put doors, yeah. Oh, okay. We'll put, probably do it double door. Because his room's going to be important. And, to be honest, I may not even have him be the one to live there. Because he's really not doing a whole lot. I 
we're going to think on that a little bit. And uh, how many bones do we have? We've got 13. Well, there goes four. And then to do a wall, I don't know if we're going to do a wall. I really don't like bone stuff that much. Let's see what this looks like. <clears throat> and if I like that, we'll go with that. Because all that takes is stone. So there's not really anything to lose there. Uh, this is Ulrich. Okay, now we can place another personal room here again. There we go. And that'll just be some random personal room that someone can come into. I guess I'll go ahead and destroy this wooden bed and just make another one because moving it's kind of a pain. And, uh, we can't put, can we? Oh, we can't put anything there. Wooden dormitory, blah, 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 blah. We really just need him to move all this sand first before we get too in-depth here. Hey, there's the arches. I kind of like those, actually. Those are kind of nice. So we'll keep those. And then we'll put some stone walls. Now, what kind of stone walls do we want? Let's see. I'll probably stick with the uh, original of what we've already got. Maybe I'll go with this. Let's see what this looks like. Oops. <coughs> Man, so many uniformists. This place is about to get overpopulated. We'll eventually turn all that sand into glass as well. But for now, now I did notice something. I had a table down here and I moved it right here. Because I noticed it was down there. And no one was able to eat at it. <clears throat> Man, that is a thick wall. Kind of sinks into the ground, doesn't it? Oh, there we go. It's because my cursor's next to it. I don't really like that that much, to be honest. Oh, Ulrich, you're helping design your own place. Aren't you just an upstanding fellow? See, I just can't really do much with walls right now because all this sand's still in the way. But we will uh, get all the sand moved eventually, and it won't be that big of a problem. Hey, another boat merchant's coming to town. What do you know? They've still got plenty of wood over there. Don't have any in here, but that's not really that big a deal. I mean, they'll move all that eventually. And, uh... So yeah, it's really just waiting on them to move all the sand. And then I will get Ulrich's place set up. Get the barracks set up. And hopefully we can come down here and get some more people. Actually, we can start that now. That's not really that big a deal. So we will... Let's see. Probably start it somewhere near this road here. Boop. And we don't want to do it like we did these. We want these to be where the doors are up so I can actually see. So we'll do them sideways. And that's going to be a wall, road, wall, okay. I think I might have made that, no, no I didn't, okay. Thought I made that one too large for a second there. And that'll give me a couple more people. There's caravans here, so let's see what he has to trade. Probably the same stuff as last time. It would appear so. He's got some doors, though. And some signs. Let's buy some wood off of him. Nine hundred and fifty. I don't really want to spend that much on wood. I can just go chop wood. It's not that big a deal. 
so he really doesn't have anything that I need. I don't really want to sell anything to him, because if I get new people in here, it uh, won't do me a whole lot of good to sell stuff. Like that armor, because I'm going to need that armor for the new people that show up. And, uh, let's see, still got plenty of meat around here. Got some cactus soup up here. Come on, guys. That takes them forever to haul stuff. A lot of sand, though. Might start just deleting some of this sand, because that's going to fill that up. That's what I'll do. I'll delete it around the side so I can get the walls up. <clears throat> Destroy all of this sand. If I had a merchant to buy the sand, I'd have a better reason to not destroy it all, but I don't. So we're, uh, while they're all hauling all this, I'm just going to sit here and destroy what I can. And so we're all working toward the same ultimate goal of getting rid of all this sand. And uh, while I was not recording, I actually put a ladder over here for this upper area. And even if you have a ladder, it seems like you can't put a personal room up there. Now, I may just be an idiot. That's always a possibility, you know. But, as far as I can tell, I was unable to put a personal room up on the second layer first layer second layer whatever you want to call that layer it's number two but it's not really ground floor so but uh anyway i was not able to put it up there now i may just be doing it wrong by all means feel free to tell me if i'm doing it wrong or what but i was unable to do it and so that's kind of neat I decided to just move it down. Eventually we're going to want roofs up here too, but I'm not really sure how to do roofs yet, so it might take a while. But once we get roofs, I mean, people won't be able to invade my stuff, first of all, which is awesome. And, uh... It'll look a lot better. What was I doing? I was, I was looking for a door. That's what I was looking for. <clears throat> Let's see. Stone arch. Now we're going to cancel a couple of these. Because we still want windows in some of these. Uh, windows on the back isn't that big of a deal. And then we'll delete this one and this one. And put some windows in those spots. And that'll look pretty nice. Let's see, right there and there. There, 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 and there. And I think that'll look pretty nice. I still haven't moved all this junk that's over here, but they'll get to it eventually. Let's look at what we have here. We've got 40 cactus fruit again. It doesn't take very long to get, does it? We've got 20 milk again. So do we have, how many of these do we have? Oh, we have 10, okay. So realistically, we could make even more of this cactus soup, but we really don't need to right now, so. Right now our biggest priority is getting rid of all this sand, because there's so much sand, it's ridiculous. We will also build Ulrich a bed at some point, but for right now, and I built his house the same way I built all of these, but this is more spacious, so it really shouldn't be that big of a problem. We haven't gotten any new people. 
It may just be because none of my people are that happy. Yeah, 1, 12, 17. No, they're not bad. But a lot of them aren't necessarily happy either. We'll uh, have to give them a break from all this work for them to really get that happy. And uh, what we'll probably do is try to make some decorative items around. Maybe some outdoor decorative stuff. I don't know how many flowers we have around here. Or bushes even. Might just take stone and build a bunch of statues. Because I don't really know how much... How many flowers we have. Let's see. Would appear... Because this is the only place I'm going to get flowers. Is on the green terrain. And it would appear that I don't really have any. Which doesn't surprise me. I mean, it's a desert planet, so... Uh, we will start it up, though. Gold, 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 gold. Everything requires so much gold. And uh, we'll try to find something that doesn't take flowers, maybe. Nope, everything takes... Bushes or flowers or... Well, that kind of sucks. <laughs> could always make flags, but that would waste my iron when I could be making armor and weapons. So it looks like our only real option is statues. A ton of statues. So we'll go ahead and just put some statues here. And then maybe throw in a gargoyle statue here, 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 and what would it be? It'd be here. And then we'll throw a regular statue, because all these other ones take gold. Here, 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 and there. And now we've got plenty of statues, and they should be happy forever. Probably not, but, you know, it's a good thought. So we'll come back next time. I'm going to pause it there. We'll come back next time and uh, try to build some of this stuff. And try to finish up on hauling and blah, 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 blah. All this other stuff. We're uh, <clears throat> kind of at a standstill now. Just trying to get some immigrants in. Beyond that, <clears throat> we will uh, work on immigrants first. Build some walls. Get them situated. And then we'll worry about heroes. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Then we will worry about heroes because heroes, before we have immigrants, more than 11 people is kind of rare. It's not impossible. I mean, on one of the basic maps, I could do it pretty easily because there's so many different opportunities to get different types of food on there. But with this, it's a little bit more difficult. Holy crap, man, they are working on those statues. Um, so we'll work on that next time, and until then, I think I'm going to pause it, and I'll actually pause the actual game so that I don't leave you guys behind, and so like, subscribe, comment, what am I doing wrong, what can I do better, tell me if you want to, uh, if you want me to cut out these parts where I'm just running back and forth, <gasps> because I could just cover the basic details of what you need to do, or I could actually have all this uh, carrying stuff back and forth and whatnot. There's a side window there. So uh, feel free to tell me if that's boring you or not, or what you think I should do next, maybe, I don't know, anything you really feel like telling me. But uh, until then, this has been another episode of Towns. Feel free to, like I said, like, subscribe, comment, and uh, I'm going to de destroy these farm fences, but I really need to pause it. So, stay tuned to watch the next episode. Thanks for watching.